These algorithms are not the focus of this tutorial. In this tutorial, these algorithms serve to show how methods in C-sharp can call themselves recursively to perform a specific function. Here is a more simple example to explain recursion. This method simply multiplies a value passed into it by a multiplier, which is also passed into this method. The third parameter is a value representing a limit on how much the x value can be incremented. So this is a pictorial representation of how this recursive method works. So each thread for an application is allocated a fixed amount of memory called a stack. A recursive method will call itself until the base case if condition returns true. And you can see that the first line of code in this method is an if statement. This is known as the base case. The repeat multiply method will be called recursively until the x value exceeds the value stored in the limit variable. So let's test this recursive functionality. And the result is as expected. The x value is first equal to 1 when it is passed into the repeat multiply method in the main method. The repeat multiply method then recursively calls itself until the x value exceeds 4000. So what happens if we omit the base case? memory space allocated for the stack is exceeded by the data occupied by this recursive process. As a result, a stack overflow runtime error is thrown. This is why it is important that an appropriate base case is included in a method that implements recursive functionality. So we can achieve the same functionality without implementing recursion through the use of a while loop. This is arguably easier to read. And as you can see, this code produces exactly the same result. Please download the code demonstrated in this tutorial from GitHub so that you can go through it at your own pace. Details of where you can download the code are provided below in the description. If you feel you have gained value from viewing this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to the channel. There's much more valuable content to come that can enhance your knowledge of programming and technology. Please smash the bell icon to be notified of future content which will be coming soon. Thank you and take care.